So what's up everyone, it's good to be back with another video and yeah, more Guardian of the Galaxy. Yeah, let me know what you think about the video or the game down in the comments section. And also don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. Tell your friends and tell your family. It's absolutely free and doesn't cost anything. So with that being said, Let's continue on with more Guardians of the Galaxy. Levers. Just save those points. What does that last line mean, Drax? Soltat Flandergath. It means we will be victorious. Moana isn't going to self destruct or anything while we're gone, right? How many times do I got to tell you? The ship probably ain't equipped with self destruct systems. All set to take on Foom Rocket? They say that a single one of his claws is bigger than a fully grown man. Uh -oh. Those legends about Hellbender turned out, that dragon's probably as tall as Groot. <laughs> Groot. You are Groot. All good, buddy. <laughs> Ready for our biggest battle yet? I am Groot. You are Groot. Great. about us killing each other over the past few cycles. <laughs> I knew this day would come. I was destined to battle the Dragon Lord of Kakaranthara. Bet you didn't think you'd be fighting him with this team of a-holes. I did not. But I am thankful fate has granted me this honor. Despite your best efforts, you are an honorable man, Peter Quill. Thanks, Drax. And Gamora. We're gonna pull this off. I know it. Of course. We have to. For Nikki. Ever fought a dragon before? Sounds fun, actually. <laughs> Only in the arcade. That's good enough, right? Okay. Let's venture out. All right, let's do this. Shivering tit wishes it's cold. <laughs> That's not really how that saying goes. You want to correct me? Or you want to find Fing Fang Foom and save the galaxy? I want Fin Fang Foom. And the galaxy saving thing, I guess. Assuming Hellbender even goes for this. Maybe Hellbender will go for it. Okay, well, I ain't seeing no Foom Foom. We should look for Katathian hunt markers. Test it. But, uh... Oh wow. You sure we'll still have a ride home with all the meteors? She can take a hit. Whoa! We did not come here to be slain by ice and rocks. There is only one noble way to die on Mark the Floor. Like so many of my people before us. Someone remind Trax we ain't come here to die. No one's dying. We're taking Foom alive. We're handing him over to Lady Hellbender alive. And we're getting her to help us take on the church's armada. So in this plan of ours, the armada part is where we die? <sighs> Maybe, but definitely not before that. <laughs> Looks like a dead end. Glorious dead end. Gotta admit, I kind of love how excited you are about all this. All right, Drax, let's channel some of that excitement toward this rock. Ah, I should have as the head of Fin Fang Foom. Great. Drax just shattered the skull of the thing we're supposed to capture. Bye-bye, Galaxy. You have nothing to fear. 
They say that his bones cannot be crushed. I am Groot. Groot says he wants to take it all in. Take your time, buddy. Might be our last chance to take anything in. Think Foom's in there? If fantasy books taught me anything, it's that dragons love to hang out inside mountains. Groot wants to know if those books said anything about catching dragons. I'm sure it had something to do with teamwork and trust. You can't remember the details because he didn't read the whole thing. I read a lot of different dragon books, okay? And there was always a mountain, and the good guys always win. <laughs> Ain't no one writing a book about us. I think I see something up ahead. Does it have big, scary claws? Look, my people were here. Didn't we see these in Drax's memories when Mantis linked us all together? Here, Katathian hunt bar. That's a lot of brave Katathians. After Thanos raised Katath, my people were left broken, physically and mentally. Their exodus led many of them here in great numbers. Uh, so how many of these hunters came back? None. They were all victims of Fing Fang Fu? Not victims. They came for the ultimate battle. A truly glorious death. Is it just me, or does it feel like we're a part of something here? Oh yeah! Part of Foom's all-you-can-eat buffet. <laughs> Walking in the footsteps of Drax's people, out here to save the galaxy, makes you want to believe in destiny. I'm not trying to kill the moment or nothing, but everybody listed here was destined to be monster chow. If we all die, we will die like proper Katathians. If we all die, everyone dies. Magus is gonna consume everything. Then let's catch Foom and make sure that doesn't happen. Foom! I'm great. <laughs> What's with all them rectangles? Monoliths. Fine. What's with all them monoliths? Uh oh. Fight, boom. Okay, 
so on a scale of one okay do i have like any points to put in to any of these heroes i do there we go i think that's them all now isn't it yeah the only one left to get their uh, um, ultimate is um, Groot. Yeah. To ten. How much bigger and stronger and scarier is Foom gonna be than the thing we just fought? Ten thousand. That's what I figured. No one said this was gonna be easy, Rocket. Right, right. But ten thousand times, Quill, Drax is the literal one. Remember? Obviously, our chances of pulling this off suck a lot. But what chance does the galaxy have if we don't pull it off? Exactly. We all saw what the church is capable of. No matter what this planet throws at us, we're not stopping till we catch Boom and Lady. I don't know why they ran up here outside. because it's down here, isn't it? Those ley lines of yours aren't leading anywhere, Drax. This whole planet is the Dragon Lord's domain. Everything leads to him. Yeah. Take it down, Gamora. Gladly. <gasps> Flark and Hala. <laughs> Got a load of them claw marks. It's gotta be Fooms, right? Bigger than his legend. So yeah, uh, when we find him, let's avoid the claws. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we need to cross here too. Just not sure how. Looks like there might be a ledge hiding under all those rocks on the other side. Okay. I'm thinking this is step one of a multi-step solution to get across this chasm. All right, and what are the next steps? Still working on that part. Incoming! So step two of your plan is crushing us all! I think I see what he's up to. Yeah, crushing us all! You got this. Certainly. Or shall I move it? Um... Bring that thing, Drax. Easily. Where shall I put it? Um, I'm not. So, are we sure the Milano's gonna be okay? Because if we end up stranded here, the Milano should be fine. I could clear the rubble from that ledge, Peter Quill. I just need something to throw. How about Quill? <laughs> Final step, Drax. If we can topple some of those rocks, we got our. Glorious! I swear, I've never seen you in such a good mood. Because you have never seen me on the great hunt before. What about our quarantine zone? Oh. You mean our quarantine zone? I mean, you don't see anything now. Yeah. great hunt. It was a regular hunt. This place has way too many caves and crevices. Everyone get ready. There's something up ahead. I'm pretty sure it sees us. Food that the of the of this Good advice. Yo. That was awesome. Ow. The bloody ball. Is that a thing we do? What if we're too late? 
What if Raker finishes what he started and the ritual... Then we're doing all of this for nothing. Not for nothing. If our final act is to challenge Finn Fang, we'll be an honorable fight. I don't do final acts. I'm a survivor. Let us hope we are not too late. There. See? More... Ominous peaks. This planet's starting to give me the creeps. I keep thinking Foom's gonna claw us from behind. Fin Fang Foom is a legendary beast. Legendary beasts do not claw from behind. <laughs> Maybe not. Smart ones do. Thank you, Noah. Let's just say we do catch Fin Fang Foom. We're just gonna drag him all the way back? I'll call the Milano over and we'll hook him up with the tow cables. I'm assuming he can survive deep space. Fin Fang Foom hunts on multiple worlds. Perfect. I guess you don't break that. I was thinking maybe you had to like break it, but maybe it's like round the side. Try that one. Careful. <laughs> That's deadly there you go, I look good, yeah, great. Yeah. She's an assassin? I bet she's gassed all kinds of famous people. So here's an idea. Why don't we lure Boom into one of these gas caves? Knock him out. I want full credit. For the last time, Drax, we're not killing Fin Fang Boom. We're catching him to get the Lady Hellbender so she forgives us and hopefully helps us fight the church. Um, I don't feel like I'm actually sitting in it. I did see my health going down, but I thought I would be able to, like, shoot it in time. I didn't feel like I was actually in there underneath it, like... How do you know? Hello? He's an assassin? So here's an idea. Why don't we lure Boom into one of these gas caves? Knock him out! Cowardly. I want full credit for the kid. Oh, the last time, Drax. We're not killing Fin Fang Boom. We're catching him to give the Lady Hellbender so she forgives us and hopefully helps us fight the church. Seems good. There we go. <laughs> I've got just the drags for this. We'll prove a little challenge. Oh, I thought maybe I'd tell like... Yeah, I just let that in there, there was one done there, and I'm like... Okay. Nice. 
face. Who will know what hit him? Who will be more resilient than a boulder? I know. I'm just trying to be Long positive. Why? I think it's a team building thing. We require no further team building. Honestly, after everything we've been through, there's no one I'd rather be doing this with. I fucking love you guys. Uh, gross. <laughs> <laughs> no! No, but uh. careful. Sir, be very sharp. <laughs> this is nothing compared to the legendary teeth and claws of Fin Fang Fu. You know, I'm gonna be really disappointed if he doesn't live up to all the hype. Yeah, imagine him as like some You're tiny little There's small thing. <laughs> Think it's Foom? More likely it's people. Great. Maybe they'll know where he is. Or they'll attack us on sight. I could probably infiltrate the camp, look for weak links, make an example of the right person, bleed them out in front of their crew. The shock of it will cause confusion or maybe even surrender. And we carve through the rest. the murdering spirit just keep in mind not everybody out there is hostile it could just be a settlement that's a dangerous assumption especially now when everything hinges on us pulling this off right and we're definitely gonna hand raker his ass and get nikki back but then afterward we're also gonna have to find a way to get back to normal this is my normal peter trust me right now you need me in murder mode just save some of it for the real bad guys Maybe dial it back to a high seven for now. Hmm. Maybe a low nine. <laughs> Come on. A low nine. El Marfin Sardu. Boom! It's boom! Yes! Boom! Oh. Yeah, Ominous is right. Okay. Huh? Well, I thought maybe you could break that, but you can't. Whoa. Is that foom? Look at the Fin Fang you see them? Big wings, nasty teeth, purple shorts. What do you mean purple shorts? What I heard he wears purple shorts. The ancient legends do tell of such a thing. See? Uh oh. This one. <sighs> Let's see those things in action. I'm on it. Oh, fire in there. Awesome. Fortune smiles upon us this day, my friends. And that one. At least 
it ain't quite as cold in this cave. You're the one with fur. Groot's practically naked. <laughs> don't get cold, but he's a big baby in the heat. I am so jealous right now, Quill. You should be. Ugh. I can't jump. It's like this magic mud stuff I used to make as a kid. There is nothing magical about mud. You haven't been to the spa in Contraxia. I have not. You strike me as the spa type. Like I said, magical. Got a better one? PD hot guns. No! Captain <laughs> Fireball. <laughs> Captain Fireball. More like a uh, heat blob. Captain Heat Blob. No, no. Costume for who though? Oh, me? Warlord? Well, it's pretty good. I'm digging it. Matches um, the scenery. It might be his name. Maybe he's trying to communicate. Please don't. Star Lord. See? <laughs> Star Lord. Is it just me, or did he sound a little irritated? <laughs> Ow. Birds. Root says they've got corrosive spores. Maybe don't get too close. Those things grow in a frozen hellscape. I think they're made of sturdier stuff than that. Twisted way. The trees are indeed twisted. Well observed. Groot says the plants here are all mean or stupid. <laughs> Press forward to a quick plasma shot. Plasma shot deals damage over time to get uh, to uh, Plasma shots deal damage over time to their target. They are especially effective against enemies with a lot of health points. Snowman! They are indeed abominable! 
Ow. Done playing with the snow monkeys. When to go? Is that really what we're calling them? Hey, they're the ones who keep yelling when to go. Maybe Hellbender will want to add some of those when to go to her army. Assuming they don't hold a grudge. Hey, they started it. So much for not holding a grudge. Barely a flesh, you'll be fine. 
Are there none left to fight? Kamura, slice him up! My foot still hurts from that slide! Are you sure you have not been bitten on the buttock? Feels suspiciously like an unproven warrior's first fight. And if it continues this way, it's gonna be our last. Come on, guys. You're not the first ones to try us, and they won't be the last. We have filled many graves. Right? There's been a thousand before them, and they all found out fast. The guardians don't break. Who's with me? Wu-Tops Field yeah! must wait! Let me in! Put you more! <laughs> yes! Bring me more! Don't weigh yourself up before the main event, big guy! Think that wreck is the camp we saw? Nah, this thing has been here for ages. Look, the smoke's coming from the other side of it. We're close, but we're gonna need to get up there. All right, crew, give me a boost. Bow, yay high. Yay is not a unit of measure. Brute knows what he means. Well, that was fun, though, that battle right there. I never truly believed this day would come. Alright, heads up! I dropped something down for you guys. Look out, Blow! Ha! Battle work! You think those creatures were using this ship for shelter? <laughs> Screw them! They're dead. I'm fine, just itchy. This dast an ice planet. Okay, let's see it if you want to like pause the video and read that. You know, if you're into the lore, stuff like that. Have lice again. Hey, you got fur? You got lice. I could shave it all if you want. Here, give me a hand. We should be ready. We don't know the source of that smoke or hostiles. Maybe it's just a nice warm fire and some cigar and spirits. Ooh, maybe it's a barbecue. What's barbecue? <laughs> what? You guys have never had barbecue? Charbroiled burgers, grilled steaks, baby back ribs? Whatever it is, it smells... Bodies. It smells of bodies. Jeez. Is all this foom? Undoubtedly. This is not good, is it? Up ahead. Looks like there's a survivor. Who goes there? Go ahead. She has no head. I believe that repulsive tentacle orb is her head. 
And I can hear you with it. Are you the only survivor? Clearly not. Who are you, Meat Sacks? We're here for film. Forget what I said. Yeah, I'm the only survivor. Or will be. I take it you know where we can find him? Sure. Digesting my men back at his roost. Big Eyes Obelisk sticking out of the Caldera's frozen sea. Don't worry, we'll take care of Foom. Sure you will, Terran. Just don't come running back here when he chases you. We've still got some things to pack up. Are you gonna be okay? I don't need your pity, Terran. I'll head back to Contraxia and lick my wounds. Ooh, hey, you may not want to do that. Contraxia isn't exactly safe right now. <laughs> when is it ever? Seriously, maybe you should just come with us. I've been embarrassed enough today without taking help from a stranger. I can look after myself. Well, if you hear people talking about a promise of the matriarch, just steer clear. I'll keep that in mind. Okay. Okay, let's get our store our shield. Marvel crafted. Here's hoping we do better against Foom than this lot. Talk to Grit. Big ice thingy on the frozen sea, eh? You said it, buddy. Sure is a long way down. Yeah, it looks good though, doesn't it? Look at that. So cool. Hm. Okay, let's go back to the workbench. We can do like another upgrade. This time, confetti jet boots. And a knockdown dash. One shiny upgrade. I've made it foolproof just for you. Another hunt marker. This one is unclaimed. No doubt it belonged to one of these corpses. Guess they never got the chance to plan it. They've appropriated it for our own use to herald our bravery this day shall mark our ultimate conquest or our glorious defeat. Foom may be bad news, but he's nothing compared to the fight that comes next. It shall mark our penultimate conquest. One conquest at a time. <laughs> Alright, people. Let's catch us a dragon. Yes. A dragon? To our great destiny. Then bang. Considering Foom obliterated that camp like it was nothing. We are not nothing. I'm with Drax. No mountain too high, no valley too low. Literally. Hey, Keith, the ice is amplifying our velocity. This is how I Best laid ever! <laughs> well, that takes care of the getting down part. I don't even want to think about how we're going to get back up. Or how we're going to get Foom up there. Look on the bright side. Maybe dead. Nonsense. Back on Earth, people would use dog sleds. A whole line of huskies pulling a sled across the ice. Don't expect me to be the dog. I was actually thinking of the Wendigo, and boom is the sled. That's the craziest idea I've ever heard. <laughs> yeah. I love it. There you go, Rocket Legs, eh? It's not that crazy. Yeah. 
So looks like we've got another costume up here. Let's see who it's for. Uh, kind of like that effect is gone. Cycles I've been sucking down air. The rodent is mentally much older than any of us. Thank you. And emotionally much younger. Har har. Oh, I didn't think it could get any colder. You know, it's days like these. I'm glad I installed seat warmers in the Milano. Up ahead, there's the ice obelisk. This must be it, the frozen sea. This is the perfect spot. Here we will challenge the great beast. Fin fang foom! Come and face your death! What are you doing? We can't get the drop on him if he knows we're here. Also, we're not killing him, remember? Shout with me. Here we demonstrate our metal. Fin Fang Foom! Your end draws near! Nope, not his <laughs> end. Your quill, go! Uh, fin Fang Foom, it's nap time! Rocket, it's your turn. Did he just say my real name? Rocket! <laughs> fin Fang Foom! We're gonna decomboggle your flock and scut spigots! You hear me? He hears you! You scaly, overgrown, mortal <laughs> splode! You fessed lump of- Go on, Grit. It's your turn next. You don't scare us! It feels good, does it not? Yeah! Yeah! It actually does! No! We just roll. Yeah, we're not doing that. <laughs> okay. Worried about the ice. If it'll hold Foom, it'll hold us. Just through here. Be ready for anything. That is technically impossible. Fing! Bang! Boom! I come! Are you? Impossible. Foom was born without fear. You don't know that. In the cold heart of a dying star. Dying stars ain't cold. This one was. You think his lair's behind that? Let's find out. Oh my god! It's Fin Fang Foom! Yo! <laughs> Ooh. Oh my god, it's still hat man. Ow! I 
associates were going to all this trouble. Ow. There we are. Um Come on you Feel free to give up boom My days, unbelievable, man. I guess when he does that, you jump on the big map, it starts from the 
Okay. Ow. Doesn't look like he's gonna make 
Take it easy on us! We screwed up. We conned you, robbed you, killed your baby. We can't take back what we've done. But we want to make it right. Uh, Quill. You murdered the Dragon Lord of Kakarantara! the two of us together. Lord Foom. The final harvest begins. Dead worlds screaming across space. We must go. Now. Someone needs to take a stand against the church. We could really use some help. You pay one debt, then create another? No, though I can kind of see... Enough. It. I will gather my forces. All right, let's go. Lady Hellbender shall fight alongside us this day. 
After we bested Foom, Foom the Invincible. We found Drax's peanut butter and chocolate. We are on the path to destiny, my friends. I still can't believe we did it. We did do it, right? We sure did, and we got Mantis back. <laughs> but we lost Warlock, and we'll need him to exercise the Magus once we shut down that ritual. So we bust him out of cult prison. I've done jailbreaks before, we all have. <laughs> we still tracking him? <laughs> oh yeah, that thing ain't coming out easy. Good. Then all we gotta do is get there on time and hope Lady Hellbender does too. Uh, she will. I'm certain of it. All right. Let's gear up, people. Tie up any loose ends. Take a pee if you have to, because we're not stopping again. <coughs> hey, Quill. Let me borrow your tunes. Why? I need the focus. Come on. Do not drop that. Mantis? What happened on Lamantis after we left? Last time we saw you, things looked dire. It's a long story. We can talk about it after you do like Star Guy says and use the bathroom. I don't need to. All right, but don't say I didn't warn you when church grandpa makes you do faith crunches. <laughs> Wait, Raker's gonna do what? It depends. But at some point, someone says my name, and then there's a little bit of pee. What the? I did not want to know that. <laughs> so that's... Oh, yeah, little I'm a mantis. A little bit of pee is you. Nope. I like mantis. He's cool. Now that's a knife. It is indeed a spectacular blade. Drax! Hey, I was just... There is no need to explain yourself, Peter Quill. Unlike the rodent, I do not mind when others are curious about my things. It's a really cool blade. With an equally impressive history. You recognize it? It belonged to Zatar the Unfinished, a great Katathian warrior king who led the first pilgrimage to Maklu 4. Wait... So you're saying this is basically Excalibur? I am unfamiliar with such a weapon. It's a mythical sword belonging to a famous Earth King. And yes, I suppose you could say this is the Excalibur of my people. It is a symbol of a king and the great hunt he inspired for those seeking to regain a place in Ultaf. Um... I think it's Excalibur? Zatar sounds like a hero of yours. King Zatar. And he is. Every Katathian warrior knows the story of his pilgrimage to Maklu 4. Why is he called Zatar the Unfinished, then? In the history of my people, a rival king attacked Zatar's lands, easily overwhelming his forces. Captured and broken, Zatar challenged the rival king to a fight to the death, but the conqueror refused, banishing him to a life of dishonor and disgrace instead. So King Zatar went to Maklu 4 to challenge the mighty Fin Fang Foom and change his destiny. Well, that's depressing. How is it depressing? Because he obviously failed. Fin Fang Foom's still alive and kicking, mostly. He did not fail, Peter Quill. King Zatar did not vanquish Fin Fang Foom, it is true. But he did redeem himself in the eyes of his people. By dying? Not exactly a happy ending. By never giving up. A warrior only truly dies when he stops living. King Zatar proved that our stories, the records of who we were in life, are ours to shape. He could have died a coward who lost his place in Ultath, or he could do what I and many of my people believe he did, change the ending of his story. The Great Hunt? So, this Great Hunt thing seems like a bigger deal than I thought. Did we mess it up for everyone by capturing Fin Fang Foom? What do you mean? Well, uh, its purpose is to regain entry into Katathian heaven and stuff, and now there's no Foom to, you know, send you there. Ah, oh, Peter Quill. There are many paths to Ultath, 
The pilgrimage to Mach Lefort is but one of them. Right. When Thanos murdered my family and destroyed my village, twice I chose the path of revenge. First I raised a small army of Katathian warriors. Even outnumbered, we cut our way through the Chitauri line and challenged Thanos himself. Wait, 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 wait. On Katath, you faced Thanos twice during the Galactic War? Yes. But I was not strong enough the first time. <laughs> strong enough to survive? Thanos allowed me and a few others to live, to set an example. Defeated and humiliated, the surviving members of my squad chose to make the pilgrimage to Maklu 4. But I could not. I continued to walk the path of revenge. Until you... You helped me put the ghosts of Hovat and Camaria to rest. To be fair, I had a lot of help. And yet you have given me a new purpose, Peter Quill. Seems my destiny was not in the mountains of Kakaranthara after all. But here, on this ship, with you. Well, I'm glad you're here with us now. I can't guarantee where our path will take us, but hopefully somewhere with lots of money and comfort. I do not have a doubt in my heart, Peter Quill, that we will have moderate success. I'll accept moderate. <laughs> Carol. Okay. Can you speak to like Mantis? I can speak to everyone. Hey Rocket. Working on something? I'm always working on something. You're not listening to my tunes? No, you turned the music on. Then can I have my player back? Why? You already got music playing. <laughs> right. So you don't need the player to focus anymore. You might turn it off. Yeah, but... What part of I need to focus? Don't you get, Quill? What do you need to focus on so badly anyway? Something that might give us a way to get through the armada around Sacrosanct. Just in case Lady Skull Suit doesn't show up in time. Nice. What is it? You'll see. You're eh? Great. Thinking. Get the watering sorted out before we go. I am Groot. <laughs> I am Groot. <laughs> he, he looks so sad, swishing around in his robes. <laughs> the, the what? What did what, he say? <laughs> Gro Groot wants to water the Grand Unifier. Oh, right. <laughs> the soaked Unifier? <laughs> the <green> humidity! <laughs> 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 okay. <laughs> Aw, she says thank you for getting rid of Aiden Warsock. Apparently she likes me better. Uh, Adam Warlock? Yeah, him. She thinks I'm bleats. It translates weird. <laughs> Mantis, I've got so many questions. I know, and I want so many answers, like, seize the means of production, or, it's not just a rash, or, yes, it is gluten-free. Uh, <laughs> not the answers I was oh, looking like for, but She's cool. I'm wondering about the questions. What questions? Hey, ask him about Lamentis. What happened on Lamentis after we left? He said some people would survive, but that doesn't fare super well for the others. Many of the elders died. They didn't resist the invasion, but they would never accept the promise. It isn't their way. I'm sorry. Don't be. Their sacrifice bought time for me and the Kotadi to hide most of the others. They will emerge when the galaxy is saved. So you're able to hide them in the caves. Hope you told them to stay away from the fog. And about Lady Hellbender? How did you convince Lady Hellbender to meet us on Maklu 4? You weren't even with us when we decided to go. Actually, convincing her to go after you wasn't hard at all. But convincing her to hear you out? Whew, that was tough. I had to get all creepy mystical and spook her with warnings about what would happen otherwise. You told her about the end of the universe, and she believed you? Oh, no, not at first. But when I brought up all her precious monsters dying, she came around. Couldn't take that chance with her babies, you know? 
Well, I'm glad to have you with us. Oh, good, because you're not always glad. <laughs> Why not? Well, oh, sometimes I'm your ex-wife. What? <laughs> I think she's pulling your leg, Quill. It only ever happens the one time, but it's so funny. <laughs> I got my mind to see. Um. You wish to practice hand-to-hand -hand techniques. It's still weird when you say Where's my name. I am getting used to it. We've come a long way since murderous sorceress. Wasn't it what you were calling me back on my first mission with the team? Yes. At first, Where's I bewitched Peter Quill. I could see no other reason he would hire an assassin for a protection contract. Really? No other reason than magic? You could also have seduced Okay, him. um... He lacks mental fortitude in the presence of women. True. If I remember right, he spent most of that protection contract flirting I'm with the waitresses. I'm so first. Bet those moves are really going to impress Lady Hellbender. I do not need to impress her. Besting the great Fin Fang Foom is proof enough of my combat skills. <laughs> yeah, that would do it. I'm not sure Lady Hellbender was really impressed with how we handled that fight. You know, since we accidentally killed that dragon before Groot revived him. Would you not be impressed by a man slaying a dragon? Maybe if he does it without my help. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Nice move there, Drax. Raker's going down this time, Gamora. I promise you. And I promise you, I'm getting Nikki out of there. No matter what. We will get her out. Together. Together. Okay, well, leave yours to it. Hey, uh, Bug Lady. You see anything about this mission we should know about? I don't see much. Or rather, I see too much. <laughs> bug so Lady. <laughs> Let's go, Bug Lady now. Is that French door open again? I swear it better not be. Oh my god, it's so rude. Oh, um, and also in one version where he grabs her butt. Wait, what? <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to leave it here. Um, because I'm pretty sure, it, like you said there, we won't stop here again. And I'm not really wanting to, like, stop in the middle of, like, missions and stuff like that. Um, so I think we're currently on chapter 13. Um... And there's 16 chapters, so I think I'll do the last video, the ending, which may take like two to three hours. So I think I'll just do that instead of like going out right now and not being able to really like save at a decent spot in the game. So yeah, let me know what you think about the game and the video down in the comment so, how was it, uh, section. With Lady Hellbender? She have you try on battle arms? And don't forget to like. No, she's very respectful of other women's bodily autonomy. We just talked. She asked about you. Uh, oh, really? She wanted to know if you'd give her your bomb recipe. <laughs> Sir Groot praised your skills at length in captivity. Are you Groot? Uh, you, you don't got to apologize, bud. Look, she can <laughs> get my bomb recipe if she pays for it. Okay. So yeah, don't forget to like, a comment, share and subscribe. Tell your friends and tell your family. It's absolutely free. It doesn't cost anything. And as always, take it easy. Have a good one. And goodbye.